what's happening, y'all. You see Grant up here. You see the moon over here. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, make sure you look into the skies this yeah. weekend. Yeah, because there's going to be a, a blood moon. <laughs> Actually, a <laughs> super flower go. blood moon Sunday <laughs> night. Yeah. Super flower blood moon. I know. What in the <laughs> world is that? I'm glad you asked. Sounds Mario. like you something out of the 70s. Let's break it down. Let's do it. Here's what we got going on. It's going to be pretty cool. The, the only issue with this is that it's going to be coming overnight. But let's talk about the super flower blood moon. Here we go. Let's bring up our, our little earth and our moon and our sun. So the, the flower part is just the full moon that happens in May. So we got that off the table. But the the blood part, or rather the, the super part, let me get this straight here. The, the super part is when the moon moves into perigee, okay? So perigee is the part of the elliptical orbit of the moon around the earth when it's at its closest point. So it's at its largest point in our sky. So that's why we're calling it a super full moon. Now let's talk about this eclipse part, which is what's going to make it blood, okay? So always the earth is producing a shadow of the sunlight coming from the sun. So when you have you have two shadows, you have the penumbra and you have the umbra shadow. That umbra shadow is created by the Earth's atmosphere refracting the sun's light. And so what you're seeing is all the sunsets and the sun rises at every single time or all at the same time. So as the moon moves into that umbra shadow, that's what gives us the blood moon during that total lunar eclipse. Head over here with me, guys, because what we're going to be working with is at Sunday night into Monday morning, really beginning at 1027. That's when the partial eclipse will begin. But at 1129 Sunday night into Monday morning, the moon will begin to turn red as all those sunrises and sunsets reflect off of the moon as the moon moves into the Earth's shadow. Maximum eclipse is at 1211 and the total eclipse will end at 1253. That partial eclipse will then end at 155 in the morning. Super flower blood moon, guys.